Hello, everybody. Uh, I hope that you had a great day. And uh, today we are going to go through them in calculus uh, regarding the chain rule. Uh, I provided this problem to Hussein to solve. Uh, that's uh, y equals the square root of x plus the square root of x plus the square root of x. So it uh, it may seem uh, complicated, but uh, it is not actually. Yeah, it so looks I, looks scary. <laughs> <laughs> no, no worries. Uh, actually, uh, I actually ask you to solve this problem using the chain rule in calculus. Yeah. So the first Thank you. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, hi everybody. Uh, as a reminder, I wanted to write the chain rule on the side uh, so we all remember what we're, we're going to use to solve this problem. So the, uh, the uh, first of all, the derivative of a square root. Um, so if the function is, why well, it's not writing. So if the function is, a square root of x, then the derivative of a square root of x is equal to one over two times a square root of x. And uh, and the chain rule, if we have uh, u or let's say if we have y in terms of... Um, y equals a square root of u. Um, yeah, I wanted to write the uh, the chain rule in general. So if we have y equal uh, equals u, and then u is a function of x, then uh, based on the chain rule, if we wanted to get the derivative of dy with respect to x is equal to derivative of um, dy over du. Uh, dy over du, correct. dy over du times du over dx. Correct. That's right. the general chain rule. Yeah. Right. So I'm going to use these two uh, these two rules here to solve this problem. So I start from this part. Define this as uh, u, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to have y equals to square root of u and the derivative of y with respect to u is u prime divided by two times the square root of u. And that is equal to dy over du. Right. Thank you. And then, um, then next I'm going to define this portion as mm -hmm. V. Mm -hmm. um, so if I rewrite U in terms of X and V, so I'm going to have U equals to um, X plus a square root of V. Mm -hmm. And then uh, derivative of U is yeah. equal to the first term. Uh, first term is derivative of x is one, and then the second term is uh, v prime divided by uh, two times a square root of v. And this v prime is a little bit tricky here because this v prime is is actually dv. Uh, with respect to x, right? dv That's to dx. Correct. That's correct. Yeah. And then uh, lastly, I'm going to use, um, so I'm going to rewrite v, which is equal to x plus a square root of x, and then v prime equals to, so a square root of the first, uh, I'm sorry, the derivative of the first term x is equal to one, the derivative of the second term the square root is one over two times the square root of x. Correct. So okay. I'm going to uh, just substitute back all the right. Terms. 
Um, so instead of this V prime here, I'm going to use this term here that I obtained here. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, probably I'm going to use the space between the lines. Uh, uh -huh. um, so tell me if, uh, if uh, this is understandable. So U prime is equal to one plus <laughs> instead of... Perhaps you use a different color. I don't know. Just just my suggestion. Or we can okay. use the same. Okay. <laughs> I, I use different color. Um, so U prime equals to one plus, instead of V prime, I have one plus one over two times a square root of X divided by two times a square root of v which is x plus a square root of x that's correct mm -hmm. and then uh i think uh once i have the u prime i can substitute back into uh this expression in the first line yeah so y prime equals to one plus uh, I'm sorry. I think, um, yeah, on the numerator, I have yeah. U prime, which is down here, one plus one plus one over two times the square root of X divided by two times the square root of Mm -hmm. x plus the square root of x and then the denominator i have two times the square root of u which is x plus the square root of x plus the square root of x that's correct yeah that's correct that's a good approach actually to substitute back all the terms to obtain dy uh, over dx. So that y prime is dy over dx. Uh, correct. So uh, you can actually highlight that term as the final solution uh, okay. to the mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, thank you Hussein, for solving that. Uh, I hope this video is helpful for everyone watching. Uh, uh, this video so if you learn something hopefully please subscribe to our channel and uh, hit the bell button and uh, until the next problem uh, take care thank you Hussein. thank you and thanks everyone for watching this video